This episode of Techno Buffalo is brought to you by Domain.com. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Mark Nsengen from Techno Buffalo, and today we're gonna to be showing you how to install Oxygen OS on your OnePlus One using a Mac. If you're on Windows, there will be instructions down below on how to properly flash Oxygen OS. Yesterday, we gave you a brief overview of what's new in Oxygen OS, so if you guys haven't seen that video yet, check out the links down below. Now, the install process is fairly easy. You should be done in about 25 to 30 minutes. So step one, make sure you've installed the ADB drivers for your Mac or Windows machine. Just download the file, which you can find in the video description, extract the android.zip file, and place that Android folder on your desktop. Now open up terminal and type cd space desktop slash android, just like how you're seeing it on screen. Next up is to install the ADB and fastboot files. So type in your command prompt or terminal dot forward slash ADB dash install dash Mac dot sh. Now, of course, this will be different if you're using a Windows machine. Step two is to download the Oxygen OS zip file and the twerp custom recovery image file, which you can find in the video description below. Place the twerp custom recovery image file along with the fastboot and ADB files inside the Mac folder, and then transfer the Oxygen OS flashable.zip file to your OnePlus One's download folder by using an app called Android File Transfer. Step three is to enable USB debugging and uncheck the update CM recovery. Now to access this on your OnePlus, go to your settings, about phone, click the build number until the developer option is enabled. Go into developer options and turn on USB debugging and uncheck the update CM recovery. Step four is to unlock your bootloader. Turn off your device and boot it up into fast boot mode by holding down the volume up and power button for a few seconds until you see fast boot mode on your screen. Plug in your device and go back to the terminal window and type in dot forward slash fast boot space OEM space unlock just like how you're seeing it on screen. Now this will reboot and wipe your OnePlus One automatically so you'll need to set up the device again. Step five is to re-enable USB debugging and unchecking update CM recovery. Turn off the device and boot it up into fast boot mode again, plug in your device, and this is where we can install the twerp custom recovery image file. Go into your terminal window and type in CD space desktop slash Android slash Mac. And once you're inside the Mac folder, type in dot forward slash fast boot space flash space recovery space TW and press tab and it should automatically fill the file name for you. But in case it doesn't, make sure the file names are the exact same. Now once you've done that, reboot the device by typing in dot forward slash fast boot space reboot. Now after that's done, you should have a custom recovery installed on your OnePlus One. Step six, boot into recovery mode by holding down both the volume down key and the power button. And once you're inside the custom recovery, first thing you wanna do is reset your device. Now again, you'll lose all your data, so make sure you backed up everything or the important stuff that you don't wanna lose. After you're done resetting your device, go to install, go to downloads and click the Oxygen OS file and then swipe to flash. Now after it flashes, reboot your device and you now have Oxygen OS on your OnePlus One. So for those who are wondering if you'll be able to go back to using Cyanogen Mod, well, the answer is yes. Although you'll have to reflash the ROM in order to get it up and running on your OnePlus One. If you guys have any questions or are stuck at a particular step, just feel free to reach out to me on Twitter or leave a comment down below. I'll try my best to answer those questions for you guys. Let me stop the video real fast and thank our friends over at Domain.com. It's the place to go when the next great idea hits you. So one stop shopping for all your domain names and web hosting email needs. Domain wants to hook our fans up with a pretty cool offer. Save 20% on domain names and web hosting if you use the coupon code TECHNOBUFFALO. It's all one word in caps at domain.com's checkout. Anyways, that's it for this video. If you guys found this video tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up and we hope to see you guys in the next one.